Hey guys, what's up? It's Zach Teensman here. Nope, no it's not. I don't even think that's a real person. Uh, hi, my name is Matt G and I, I'm, I'm on the internet. I got a text message from Brian Stars asking me to make a video to fill in for, for Austin this week. Apparently Austin is way too busy making a tour, on a tour, still something with a tour. I don't know. Uh, and I guess when there's a tour, you're too busy to make a video. I'm just kidding, it's probably a lot of work. How would I know? So I guess this week is challenge week, and because I I guess I'm challenge guy, Mushy. they asked me to fill in. So I went to my Facebook and my Twitter and I asked my viewers for challenges and whatnot to give me for this video. And a lot of people got excited, thought I was bringing back Dare Matt G, but this is different. This is, this is challenge Matt G. Um, the difference being, uh, so before I get into all the challenges and stuff you guys sent in, Let's take a look at the ones I'm not doing. Like that one. Nope. Mm-mm. Nope. Nope, not, not, gonna, not gonna bother. So I hope you're ready to watch a grown man compromise his dignity here on the internet. Cause what else are we doing, really? Powdered Tang Challenge. One man, one spoon, one bad idea. We don't have any clean spoons and that's just the truth. So I'm gonna do this the same way the indigenous tribes of Tom Papa New Guinea used to do to achieve a higher level of existence. <coughs> Tang is what the astronauts drink in space. But not like this. <coughs> Never like this. I'm gonna do one more attempt at it, you know, rule of three for comedy. <laughs> the clothes pin your nipples. Well, all right. This is. That's what a grown man's nipple looks like. It's all, it's all gross and weathered from living. That's... Oh, no, put the shirt down! Ow! This is uh, my Thursday nights. Usually, this is a little tender because it's Saturday. This person challenged me to put my leg behind my head because they don't think I can. Ugh. Come on, motherfucker! <sighs> You're right. The blindfolded makeup challenge. There's not really much of a description on that. I don't really know what I'm gonna be doing, but let's do it. All right, so I went, so I went to the dollar store and I bought, I bought some, some lipstick and some eyeliner. Um, but I won't lie, if these things didn't have labels on them. I have no fucking idea what they were. Up until yesterday, I just I thought that lipstick was for writing dirty messages to myself on the mirror. Turns out it goes on your face. You know, it's not super hard um, to put lipstick on. I don't see what the big problem is that everybody has with putting on makeup uh, with their blindfold on. Because really, I think as long as it's on your lips, you, you're, you're doing it right. It's, it's not called exactly perfectly on your lips stick. Huh, I, I, I'm blindfolded. It means my eyes are closed. I really didn't think this through. Uh, it's, it's, it's fine though, because from what I've learned from the internet, eyeliner is really supposed to go anywhere but your eyes. So I'm just gonna draw eyes on my cheek with it. Uh, just, now I'm gonna align the eyes with the eyeliner like this. Uh-huh, uh-huh, and this one over here, we'll just put some eyeliner on that, and now you're ready for that job interview that you've been looking forward to, or like school or something. I'd, I'd like to uh, I'd like to take a look at what I look like. Oh god, no. See how many marshmallows you can put in your mouth with your feet. I'm not exactly sure if you knew this about me when you sent me the challenge. But I can kick myself in the face, so this should be pretty easy. Oh, no! Ah! 
Ah, come on, come on. Oh. Partway through that, I realized that that was probably the grossest thing I've ever done. The Commit Increasingly Worse Crimes Challenge. Well, I'm kind of already winning that because I'm not paying my taxes. It's called fraud, and it'll get you a nickel in the clink. Build a fort in under two minutes. Oh, oh, what the fuck have I done? Tape the nearest thing to you. And I know that they said just, just to tape the nearest thing to me, but I think what they meant was to tape the nearest thing to me. You know, this isn't really a challenge. Um, this is just a pillow taped to me. Make guacamole with your face. You know, I really hope the recipe to guacamole is avocado and face. Because that's how we're making it. Smells like a festival of flavor. Wax your legs. I don't have wax for my legs. We're gonna go with the next best thing. Uh, <laughs> all right. One, two, ah! Done! Ah! Ah! <sighs> what has my life become? Go streaking! Uh, I, I can't get naked. Bad things happen to good people when I get naked. Ah, these goddamn clothespins! Well, I hope you enjoyed. Well, I hope you enjoyed Challenge Matt G. I don't, I don't know if I'm supposed to self-promote or not, so I'm just gonna do it anyway. You can see more of my ageless face on youtube.com slash mattg124. I, I make jokes, and I used to have a series called Dare Matt G. Um. Oh, see you later.